nation, among the God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. <coughs> Davis? Here. Parker Absent Schneider? Here. Stoops? Here. Wilson? Here. Zukas R? Here. Zukas W? Here. Um, Jason did call that we won't make the meeting tonight. I know you're getting kind of a little concerned about this, so I don't know if someone wants to make a motion to excuse him or just. I'll make a motion to excuse the Support. Parker Absent Schneider? Yes. Stoops? Yes. Wilson? Yes. Zukasar? No. Zukas W? Yes. Davis? Yes. Yeah. Parker Schneider, Stoops, Wilson, Zukas W, Davis? Yes. And Zukasar? No. Non agenda items from the sidelines. Uh, Mr. Garvin, do you want to make a, a comment? Here? I just want to follow up on everybody knows. Pretty much, this started a month or so ago, and I'm calling it now total harassment. This last incident, last week, I'm not going to go into it, most people want to know, know about it. And the only thing I can say is the people that are involved doing this, have the mindset of an eight-year-old. It is something that actually scares me a little bit, and I think a little bit more people ought to be scared. And in this past two weeks, week, 10 days now, I, but before that, I had about at least 25 people come up to me and say, hey, you know, this and that, you know, you just hear this whole shit. And last, after the last incident, I contacted five or six of them. I got a hold of them one way or another, and I just quit. I asked them just to show up at the meeting. Just be here. Don't have to say a damn word. And every one of them said, no, I, Jim, I can't do that. I will not become a target of that guy I met with. If I do this, I know I'll be a target. I have to drive through that town. I will be a target. No, I will not be there. Now, in small town USA, we the people of our free liberty, land of the free, and we've got people afraid to protest to a Keystone cop that they might be targeted by, well, now, where, where are we at? Where are we, in China, Russia? Where are we? This is total baloney. It's just, I, I don't want to yell. I got mad, I blew it the other night. I just blew up when it, the second incident happened. And I don't need to do this. Probably the last time we're going to come to one of these meetings, but I want you all ought to be afraid if you want these kind of incidents. They grow, spread. You've got a police state, and this is just exactly when you've got people afraid of a small town cop. Then we've got something to worry about. And believe me, I'm tired of being harassed. I want, I do want you to know that I'm not afraid. And you're not going to scare me with your tactics. I want you to know that. And that's all I've got to say. Um, Jim, um, uh, do we have to amend the agenda and discuss this uh, a little bit later? Or or do you want to discuss it now? Or we amend the agenda and discuss it? Yeah, we'll amend the agenda. All right. Jim, if you want to stay around for a while, we'll discuss this in open session and down the agenda. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. 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 Th
comments from the city administration, Donna? Um, that was sweet. It's going to respond to uh, wait until after this uh, special. As you all know, is the, I believe you have some information. I got stamped as information only regarding a lagoon visit, uh, which was satisfactory. Uh, the other one was the water tower. Um, they're looking at 2020. Eric mentioned we got uh, five years to save up for that wet year. Uh, what they're expecting uh, to be That's uh, That's good because we did discuss in the budget it could be an item. It's kind of new, but uh, five years, that's great. Yes, that's great. What about the generators? Generators are still up in the air, and uh, this, the lift station is, it appears I'm going to need it for the wells. And that's a more costly generator in 483 phase versus the 223 phase. So I haven't got confirmed yet. Record my sources as of January 1st of 2016. You are supposed to have an automated system that will back up power on me to walk into your water system. Yeah. <coughs> right now we have the big portable one we tie in, but, uh, but I may have to be complete hooked up. But hook up uh, I want to go a little further with it and see if I've got to beyond January. back to take us to the casino. So they called me and canceled and I had to call everybody up and tell them it was canceled. And I'm trying to reschedule as soon as I get a hold of the owner over there and see what kind of deal he's going to give me to compensate me for my time on that. So, um, but that's all I have. Okay. I have a question. So you, I know you said you had to do the Tigers game sign up by the 12th, but when is the game? It's the 19th of July. Tigers want their money a uh, month in advance. How was the response been so far? I've got one person signed up. <laughs> okay. And me and my wife said it'll be three. <laughs> so you need about 45 more people or something, right? Uh, the, well, I've got a buster. Um, i got 40 seconds sitting there. So we have, need to get at least 40. Have you run it on paper? It's in the paper. It's on Channel 6. It's it's out there. So. Oh, and it did? That's it. Oh, okay. thank you. Uh, adoption or amendment agenda. I understand there's going to be two amendments then. There'll be one for uh, the uh, complaint uh, against uh, Sage Creek. Uh, so, um, uh, let's see. Where is it number four? So that would be number four then? That would be number four. Uh, okay, and uh, number five, uh, I think you have a, a amendment there. Uh, yeah, Frank. it will be uh, the 
concerning police uh, chief uh, sheets uh, job performance. Okay, uh, chief, this is uh, um, personal in nature, and you have a perfect right to have that in closed session or open. What would you prefer? Close. Close. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. Then um, why don't we put that down then just after uh, uh, like C um, the other uh, uh, yeah just before yeah put it there. Okay, if there's no others then I'll have a motion then to approve the uh, agenda as uh, amended. I'll make the motion. Sport. Schneider? Yes. Stoops? Yes. Wilson? Yes. Zukasar? Yes. Zukas W? Yes. Davis? Yes. Herker Hampson? Okay, the uh, next is the uh, approval of the regular min uh, uh, minute meetings of uh, May 19th and our special budget meeting on May 20th. We read those over and there's no changes. I think we have motion to approve both of those. How many motion we accept the both minutes from both meetings as presented? Okay. Stoops? Yes. Wilson? Yes. Zukasar? Yes. Zukas W? Yes. Davis? Yes. Parker, Epson, Schneider? Yes. I need approval then for the May disbursements of uh, $111,734.92, electronic wire transfers of $17,294.30. I'll make a motion to uh, approve and pay the bills. Four. Wilson? Yes. Zukasar? Yes. Zukas W? Yes. Davis? Yes. Parker Axon Schneider? Yes. Stoops? Yes. No communications, no unfinished business. So new business, uh, administration uh, memo, not memo number nine. Now this is just to clean up some uh, budget amendments and, uh, for, on the elections, police department and safety inspections. So, uh, so I need a motion to approve that. What do we uh, approve this budget amendment uh, to clean up the Finances. Support. So, yes, sir. Wait, before we vote, I, I do have a question. Um, yep. So, as far as this reimbursement for the election, yes, we don't know for sure that would be reimbursed. No, no they will, will reimburse. They will. I don't know if it will be this month. I mean, June. I see. It might come in next fiscal year. Yeah, that that will yeah will be reimbursed for all that. But uh, when you're getting near the end of fiscal year, so when it comes in ahead of time, I think we don't know. So, okay. so that's Thank you, sir. Yes. So, can stop you? Yes. Davis? Yes. Parker Epson Schneider? Yes. Stoops? Yes. Wilson? Yes. Next on the agenda is the uh, Macomb County Animal Control Regulations. Uh, we have adopted this uh, prior to this, but this is just a uh, revised, a uh, few things are revised in it. As in the revision is May 2015. It's quite extensive, it's certainly not going to be uh, publicly. But it's just simply a revision of uh, some things that's in there. So we do have to adopt it. So um, if there's no question, if there is any questions on it, we'll take it. If not, I can uh, entertain a motion to adopt the Macomb County Animal Control Regulations as, re as revised in May of 2015. It would be available in the office here if anybody wanted to look at it. Yes, definitely. I'll make the motion. Four. W? Yes. Davis? Yes. Parker Absent Schneider? Yes. Stoops? Yes. Wilson? Yes. Zucas R. Yes. Next is the resignation of our building inspector, Brian uh, uh, Denno. I, from the feedback I've been getting, has been doing an excellent job, so we're kind of sorry to see him leave, but uh, due to personal reasons, I'm no longer able to fulfill my obligations as the building official for the city of Memphis. And please consider this my letter of uh, official resignation. My last day of work will be July the 1st, 2015. So I we need a motion to accept its resignation uh, effective that day. I'll make the motion. Support. 
Davis? Yes. Parker Hampson Schneider? Yes. Stoops? Yes. Wilson? Yes. Stukas Hart? Yes. Stukas W? Yes. Uh, to get the uh, interview um, perspective uh, replacement today, um, Bobby, myself, and Donna. And uh, I won't give you his name uh, at this point because we do our champions references. Uh, he appears that uh, from uh, his uh, resume and his interview that uh, he certainly would be acceptable. Uh, we will review his uh, and check on his references, and uh, if everything checks out, uh, we'll be back to council on the 16th. Larry, did he come to us or did we call him? Uh, we got him through uh, references from Brian. Uh, See how we see what happens, and, uh, but I won't mention his name because I don't want to change his name. Okay, the next is the uh, Sage Creek uh, complaint. Uh, um, complaint. Um, as you know, and I've said uh, this originated back uh, a few weeks ago, uh, I did uh, go over and see. Uh, Jim, I went through his uh, his, uh, his new uh, winery over there. Uh, he's been doing very extensive renovations inside. Uh, he acknowledged that there does, at that time, there has to be some interior work uh, done. Uh, that he, as soon as some resources and time, he would uh, address that issue. Uh, I did write a memo to come to the police department and to the council uh, requesting some latitude uh, on the other business that got the same light. They did uh, uh, rescind that in the sense that it was a work in progress. Uh, I thought they would do the same thing with Mr. Gavin, however they didn't. Um, I was gone last week, but I, when I was in town on Friday, I seen uh, uh, him out there uh, stripping uh, paint off the front, uh, taking steps to uh, comply with that. Uh, that Late that day, he got another complaint and given him five days in which to respond. I believe the five days is up tomorrow, I believe, I'm not sure. Uh, however, uh, I personally think uh, He's doing an uh, excellent job over there. He's also under the uh, guidance right now of our building inspector on the interior work. Uh, I really think um, that he should be allowed some latitude. Um, I don't know what our council members have on this, uh, but uh, entertain anything they want to say. Has the police committee discussed this issue? Right here. The police committee uh, recommends that the body issue concerning and regarding the uh, Sage Creek Winery be uh, rescinded and ceased immediately uh, and that no further action be taken as long as the building is being worked on. Okay. you have any response? Yeah. Um, the letter states if there's any concerns uh, you can call. I had communication with the other individual involved in understanding it's a work in progress. We are more than happy to uh, assist in that. If, if it's a large project, this, that's not a problem. Uh, just like many of the other businesses, uh, we will receive place and residential will receive place. We're not here just to write tickets. We're here to make sure they uh, update their house or make any necessary repairs. But now if it extends, that's not a problem. As long as there's a work in progress, it's all that matters. Um, so that's where we're at with that. I only have one major concern with uh, that location. It's a uh, second story window that is missing the bottom pane. It's my fear that the bottom, uh, the uh, window falls out since the parking lot's right there and cause some serious damage to uh, someone that might be walking by. Uh, that was um, my biggest concern right there. Now, as far as- Was that noted in the complaint? Was that, that I don't know. I, I did a follow up. Um, with the complaint lady with all the properties. No, I mean the second story window. Was that complaint? I don't recall. I don't have the report in front of me. It, it was that in the complaint? It, no, it wasn't. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what he's talking about right now. We look out the door and uh, the second the second window in the middle upstairs in the rear 
is missing the bottom pane, so there's nothing holding the window in place. Yes, the outside window to the rear. So the whole the piece of wood holding it in place is I, gone. If it's there, I'm not aware of it. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how to answer that one right now. I don't have an answer. Okay, but I mean, I don't. I don't have a problem uh, as long as it's a work in progress. And you know, in, in all honesty, in the last two years of the light investigations, we've uh, done one, issued one citation. We're more than happy to work with anyone uh, that needs more time, and we've done that in the past, and uh, we'll always continue to do that. And no one's being targeted, though. Uh, it's you know, spring coming into summer, and uh, it's uh, blight season, so um, we have nine investigations just in May for uh, blight. Uh, no one's being singled out, and it goes all over the city to residential, uh, to business. Okay, so I, I think then, uh I think then that this can be uh, dropped right now. You, you might look at the window check if there is a problem, maybe it does but I think then this should drop. I think this is uh, uh, and, and I believe the committee is, that's what they're recommending. Is that correct, Frank? That's correct. Then I think it's done. I know you sent a letter, you give me a letter also that you want uh, part of the uh, minutes is on your health problems and, and, and you've got to contribute oh. some of this to the community. Yeah, that was I just want that part of the record. Okay, that would be part of the records. Okay. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Okay, from the uh, mayor, I don't have anything uh, further. City Council. I just want to mention that the Lions Club will be having an art show uh, the 5th and 6th, Friday and Saturday, for artists to uh, show or sell whatever they want to do with their art. It's not a craft show, it's, it's just art. Uh, so if you have an artistic um, ability and you'd like to show people how you do it or what you have, we'd love to have you come out and, uh, and be part of our art show. The time. I think it's um, noon to six on Friday and ten to maybe it's noon to eight on Friday and ten to six on Saturday, something like that. Could be crowded up there. Anything else? It's always crowded up there. Well, I think the Faisal's got their picnic. I think in the back this weekend, yeah, the pavilion as well. Uh, that's all I have. Okay, soccer. Frank, anything? Uh, no, I understand. Yeah. No. Could I have a motion to go into executive session? So moved. 